The Iranian team Svahan was supposed to host El Ittihad Saudi team as part of the Asian Champions League this week. But the Iranian regime used the game for a political statement. They placed a statue of our IRGC leader Qasem Soleimani, who was widely considered one of the biggest terrorists in the world until he was assassinated in 2020. This same Soleimani led the regime's effort to surround its two biggest enemies, Israel and Saudi Arabia, with pro-Iranian regime terror groups by financing terror organizations and sending them weapons. Soleimani's statues is an unprecedented act in football and is intended only to politicize sport. In response, the Saudi team rightfully refused to play before the statue, which led to the cancellation of the game. Incredibly, the Iranian fans sided with the Saudis, responding by chanting against the Iranian regime, shouting death to the dictator. While Israel and Saudi Arabia are moving towards a historic peace agreement, the Iranian regime is feeling the heat more than ever. Just this weekend, in a military parade, they threatened to wipe out Israel. While the world is mostly turning a blind eye to the provocations of the Iranian regime, it is good that the Saudi Al Ittihad team refused to be part of it. We in Israel send you our support, and inshallah, inshallah, we will soon see games between Israeli teams and Saudi teams, both in Jerusalem and in Riyadh. Amin.